tennis briefs, Eugenie Butchard bounces back, Greek Freak gets his revenge Eugenie Butchard has broken a nine-month route, finally re-entering the winner's circle after claiming her first singles victory since February. The Canadian tennis star bounced back by defeating Greece's Valentini Gramatikopoulou 7-6, 7-4, 6-4 in the opening round of the Oracle Challenger Series event in Houston, Texas, on Tuesday morning, ADT. Pouchard's last singles victory came in the first round of an event in Dubai in February, when she toppled Belarusian Vera Lepko in straight sets before losing to this year's Wimbledon champion Simone Halep in the second round of the UAE-based tournament. After that, Pouchard suffered 12 consecutive first-round exits to extend her losing streak to 13 as her world ranking plummeted. The 25-year-old lost to Serena Williams in the second round of this year's Australian Open but was unable to make it that far in any of the remaining three Grand Slams in 2019. Pouchard's win in Houston has bumped her world ranking up to 220 and with a couple of more wins later this year and early next year, she will be in the frame for Australian Open qualifying to give herself a shot at entering the main draw at Melbourne Park. After her 12th straight defeat, to Anastasia Sevastova at the US Open in August, Boucher admitted the constant stream of poor results was getting to her and she had her eyes set on starting fresh in 2020. I can't wait to win a match, Boucher said after her exit from Flushing Meadows. I'm sick of losing. I'm obviously still going to play tournaments this year but I'm going to try to really work physically. I think that's lacking a little bit right now. Keeping working on my game, add tools and start next year really strong, Stefanus Tsitsipas beat Dani Almedvedev 7-6, 7-5, 6-4 in a high-quality battle of the debutants at the ATP Finals on Monday. Tsitsipas, the first Greek player to qualify for the end-of-season tournament, had lost all five previous matches against the Russian, but turned the tables in impressive fashion. The 21-year-old served superbly and did not face a single break point as he took his chances in clinical fashion to the delight of the London crowd. Playing the more adventurous tennis, Tsitsipas earned a set point in the opening set tie break with a volley onto the sideline and converted when Medvedev netted a forehand. Striking the ball with venom, the swashbuckling Tsitsipas earned three break points at 3-3 in the second set but Medvedev responded with some gutsy tennis to hang on. A misjudgment by Medvedev at 4-4, leaving a ball that landed on the baseline, gave Tsitsipas another break point and this time he took his chance. Tsitsipas, who won 39 of 44 points when he landed his first serve, claimed victory with a smash. I had goosebumps today. Playing on this court that I dreamt of playing on, it's pure joy, Tsitsipas said. This was one of my most important victories of my career so far. Everything worked pretty well. Not easy coming in knowing you have lost five times but I made a deal with myself that I would keep trying, Tsitsipas also said the tension in the pair's relationship motivated him to perform. It's a victory that I craved for a long time now. And it's great that it came at this moment, Tsitsipas said. Our chemistry definitely isn't the best that you can find on the tour. It's not that I hate him, but, we will not go to dinner together, the grudge dates to their first meeting, in Miami last year, when Medvedev berated Tsitsipas for not apologizing after hitting a net court during a point, a spat that ended with both players trading insults on court. Please save trees and nature. Please subscribe my channel. Thank you. Tennis Briefs, Eugenie Butchard bounces back, Greek Freak gets his revenge Eugenie